Hey guys, this is James. Just K. Just K for Rizzle. Just K for Rizzle. Just K for Rizzle. <laughs> Welcome back everybody for another episode of Just Kidding Around. So a few weeks ago, uh, the quarantines were just kind of starting to set in and we were trying to come up with a few ways to like hang out with our siblings. So we went for a walk with them and it was a super windy day. And my brother commented on how he wished he had a skateboard so that he could like hold his jacket up, you know, how you always kind of want to do that when it's really windy and help it like blow him along. And then James got to thinking. I could never skateboard. But, a long time ago, these happened, so we kind of formed some teams and had a competition to see who could, well, make the fastest land parasail, I guess? This is my sister, Amy. She's a special guest today. This is my brother, Turner, aka Bob Chick. Alright. Is Amy going to get Amy? Could that be funny? You didn't turn it! Okay, All so right. these two against us two. Here we go. <laughs> we'll want, basically, we'll want the rope to we'll see how long the rope is. Amy died! Oh no! <laughs> So we broke into teams and each team got one twin size bed sheet, a bundle of rope, we had access to fishing line, duct tape, and a bundle of sticks. Other than that, the entire design was completely up to each team. We each did similar designs, but we took slightly different strategies. So you'll kind of get to see that here in a second. And as you can see here, it was definitely a windy day because our plans kept blowing away on us. Here, come over here, Amy. Stand by the brick. And then down a little bit. Yep. Okay, so our strategy is we put rope through each corner. So each side will come back to a handle made out of duct tape. And I think we have it all centered and folded, so we should throw it in there. And then we'll just have control of each, each side with each handle. And if we need to let go, we can let go of our Because simplicity. Yeah, go team. All right, so our strategy uh, is to create a holding handle on the ends, but we're also going to use some sticks as spacers to keep the edges to stand tall so they can stay open and catch as much of the wind as possible. We're confident that this is either going to work super well or it's going to disastrously, dis disastrously, <laughs> disastrously tear itself apart. Gosh, okay. everybody's a critic. I haven't been on rollerblades in, I might have been 10, 10 years at least. How Maybe long has it been since you rollerbladed, Pick? About the same as James. Oh. Can you get in? Yep. <laughs> yeah, well, oh, one of the straps, two of the straps broke. Oh. Alright, I'm going, all, all <laughs> yeah. the straps are broken. Oh, yeah, I'm cool again, guys. Oh, no angle for no Oh, yeah, you're definitely gonna need the, um... Turn on your <laughs> <laughs> I think you're gonna achieve a new oh. world record for speed at that pace. So, like, we can, like, we can use the spare rope to tie you. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Guys, why do your stroller blades not work? Because they're all old and broken. Okay, okay, I'm out of the way. Just stay on. Just stay on? Okay. 